Hey everyone, DFA here. Welcome back to the channel. And today I'm going to test an epic commander, which has an interesting skill. It's called Tanaka. Let me show it to you. Yep, here it is. And you see it has a torpedo squadron skill, which gives you engine accelerator, 50% damage by torpedoes to module, but also 20% torpedo concealment, minus 20% torpedo concealment. So let's take a look at what that concretely means in action. For that, let's head into a training room. So I will be testing against, yeah, that's my Odin by the way, so that's my uh, regular account with the Odin, no commander on this one, and I will be testing against my press account with an Akatsuki first without the uh, epic commander and then second with the epic commander to see what that concretely means. How much time does that skill give us to <laughs> evade torpedoes? So let's take a look at it first without the commander. And here we are, the Akatsuki at a distance of 7 kilometers magically appears and yeah, it's more or less parallel to us, so the angle at which the torpedoes are coming does not influence the detection speed and sure enough, what do we have right in front of us? Yeah, it will take about 8 seconds and a half to uh, react before the tor after the torpedoes are detected. Now, what happens when I activate a sonar? Obviously, the torpedoes are actually detected even before the sound animation of the sound clip is triggered, telling the torpedoes are headed towards you, and you get about 13 seconds and a half to react. So that's about 5 more seconds than without the uh, sonar. Now let's do that again, but this time with Tanaka. So yeah, press account is back, and with the epic commander this time, let's go back to the training room. Here's the Akatsuki, still about 7 kilometers torpedoes are detected and this time, yeah, we 6 seconds and a half to react, so that's about 2 seconds less than with the, uh, without commander actually, or with any regular commander. Now with the sonar activated, the duration is still around 13 seconds and a half, so the epic commander has no effect on the detection time of torpedoes. If the sonar is activated, the sonar detection range is still uh, having the advantage here. Now, if you do not have a sonar, there is still a commander skill that you can activate the torpedo alert, which will increase the detection range of torpedoes by around 15%. And I'm going to take a commander which has that skill equipped and put it on my Odin. Now, I remember testing this from my commander skills guide video. I put the link in the comment section below. And I found that it increased the detection time of about, of the reaction time about one second. And therefore, not super useful. What is it going to be this time with the epic commander in front of us? And it does have a very small effect, a little bit less than seven seconds. So that's a bit less than half a second on top of it. So yeah, not super, super useful, to be honest. And with this sonar, it's not cumulative, the detection time or the reaction time, it's still around 13 seconds and a half, so let's move on. And yeah, this time let's test it with deep water torpedoes. Let's bring the Yudachi in those torpedoes as supposed to be more stealthy and less detectable. Let's see what it is in real life. Oh, back to the training room. So we are still looking at the Yudachi, about 7 kilometers, still more or less parallel to us, and this time so first without the epic commander, he had the torpedoes. And yeah, this time poor Odin only gets 5 seconds to react, so yeah, the deep water torpedoes are indeed more stealthy and a little bit faster. And note that activating the sonar does not change anything with deep water torpedoes, you will still get about 13 and a half seconds to react once you detect them. And so, final test, let's bring back the Epic Commander to test with deep water torpedoes, and let's go back to the training room. And the Yudachi is back in its place. Suspense, suspense, here they come. How much time do we have? Ooh, ay, 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 ay. And yep, this time you only have 4 seconds to react, so that's one less second than... <laughs> without the commander. So there you go, that was the verdict on Tanaka, a pretty useful commander if you ask me, just don't use it with ships that are actively engaged with the sonar because there it will not make any difference. There you go, end of the training room footage for this week, I hope you found this useful and interesting and I will see you next week, bye bye!